In the Queensland election, well done to the Liberal Party because they made the decision, Greens go last, right? That's exactly what the position should be. In my view, uh, you know, there's, there's no case for the Greens being anything but uh, at the very bottom of the ticket. There may well be a certain person in a certain seat, but as a rule dead last, right? Um, well, Jewish groups have actually got together with uh, other minority groups and are trying to inform the public about how ethnic minorities are not, in fact, best represented by the Greens, who, of course, remember, tried to pretend that they are, you know, sort of the uh, Aussie version of the United Nations, etc., etc. Um, Michael, what do you think... Uh, I know you speak very warmly of the decision that the Libs have made in Queensland. I hope it's one that happens nationally. Uh, we all know Labor should, but won't. Because literally, uh, there would be a lot bigger number than seventy. We'd be potentially talking about here as a, as a potential government. But it's good not just to to make these moves, but also for people to be willing to put up posters and send the message to the average voter, so they know the Greens equals something other than what the Greens are putting their own posters up about. This is just a fantastic development. The the, the, the fact that. Some of the Jewish community, the, the, the Hindu community, are, are, are getting together um, to basically say these people don't represent minorities. And, uh, it, you know, they may not get a huge number of votes, but they're making the point to people, putting pressure on the Greens, to get people to understand that this group that talks a big game are basically a hard-left, fanatical, extreme, pro-anarchist organisation that are not the friend of minorities unless they're Palestinian extremists in this country unfortunately. But the bigger question is not so much about the Queensland election, because we know Stephen will be looking for a job after the election up there. The bigger question about Queensland is the federal seat of Griffith. You keep your eye on this mm. seat, because Max Chandler mm. Mather, who is the Greens member, was only elected mm. because he got Labor Party preferences, right? Mather got... Chandler Mather got 35% of the primary vote. Labor came third. They preferenced him and he won. So, hello, Mr Albanese. You're yeah. going to preference him again and get him elected? You're going to do that, Mr Albanese? This is the bigger question. Not what the Liberals are doing, because they've got a principled stand in Queensland and Dutton will do the same Australia-wide. These people are going last. They are, they are extremists who will ruin this country. The question is, is Albanese going to have the guts to do the right thing by middle Australia and say, yep, we agree, the Greens are going last, we're preferencing the Liberals? Or is he going to preference the Greens? Because if he does, that'll be the end of him. Well, and, and also, my, I agree, but also the thing here, Bronwyn, is, is that, as I said, we've seen this you know, kabuki theatre of them pretending to be at war with each other, being Labor and the Greens, where the reality is that they're always going to end up either electing each other to Parliament or certainly supporting each other um, in a Parliament. What do you think about what Michael just said? I agree with everything Michael said. I just wish we had uh, put the Greens last when we gave preferences to Mr Bant. He got elected on Liberal preferences. Correct. And look what we've got as a result. So hopefully that mistake will never be made again. Yeah. But the bottom line is this. Mm. The Greens hate the Australian country, people. They hate the concept of the nation state. They want to see the populace dumb, dumbed down so that when they rise up to be the elitist leaders, they have absolute control. And everything about them is almost evil. They are really bad people. And if you listen to their rhetoric, listen to carefully to what they say, you wouldn't feed them. But, of course, Albanese will get them. Of course, we are speaking in metaphors for those that are getting ready to write their letter of complaint. Uh, we are speaking in political metaphors. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. The, but the point is that they hate mm. Australia. <laughs> they just hate Australia.